is this? Is this a video under 20 minutes? Can I get through a video without touching my hair? Like, please. It drives me crazy when I watch it back. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new. My name is Will and today we're going to be talking about Seven Seeds. So Netflix had been recommending this anime to me and I kept like ignoring it um, because I obviously wanted to watch what I wanted to watch. And you know, I kept looking at it and then I said, okay, let me watch this anime. I mean, it's just two seasons so far and um, it's, I think it's about 13-ish episodes each and i watched it and i actually really enjoyed it and i haven't really seen or heard anyone talking about it so yeah i figured i'd make a video people who are of age can you please take a shot every time i say interesting i want to see something okay i'm going to give you my spoiler free review of this anime and hopefully it will encourage you to watch it because i think it's really interesting i think it's kind of different it's not your usual you know the usual popular type of genres of anime um yeah so let's get into it so it's basically about a group of people who survived a shipwreck and the i don't know if it's like an island or the the place <laughs> that they managed to land on <laughs> the piece of land that they managed to land on um, is basically inhabited by plants, insects, and animals that have technically become the top of the food chain and it's really dangerous and they need to navigate the terrain and yeah, there's obviously a lot more to the story than that but for the spoiler free people, that's the best I can do. <laughs> there are actually quite a number of characters in this anime and I actually really bonded with quite a few of them and obviously there's some that i hated no matter what and when you watch it you can give your own opinions on whether i'm right that i hate them but um yeah there were a lot of characters i really loved a lot of characters that i hated initially but started to like it's actually got a lot of themes adult themes but it's not um it's not like itchy or whatever it's just it just it's just it's a bit you know it's chill it's chill um mature ish um it's yeah <laughs> i don't know what <laughs> it's not hentai the world itself is very interesting um i really enjoyed seeing the animals the life-threatening vegetation and insects it was very interesting and Seeing the way that they navigate through the world trying to survive was actually very fun because the stakes always felt really high even though even though sometimes you could predict that oh, okay in the end it won't be that bad um, but like you still felt like you're on the edge of your seat and you're you know you're rooting for the people you're rooting for you know and there's a lot of people you know that people tend to die so yeah but i think they did a good job of not trying to just give us too many shock deaths it was yeah you know it's just balance you know give us heart attacks but also give us rational <laughs> outcomes like i said earlier it's got some heavy themes um some of them political, some of them are very morally placed, like what would you do for the best of the group or the, you know, like what decisions would you make that may be morally unacceptable, but the outcome, you know, outweighs the necessity for you to be a decent human being, basically. Yeah, you know, it's like, a, it's it's got so many layers to it, um, so many I don't want to spoil this anime. Yeah, it's got so many layers to it and it's very interesting to see the way the characters, you know, their characters, thought processes and, you know, oh, and also it's really nice to see their backstories as well and how that shapes them for the situation that is before them. It's actually really interesting to see. This show actually has a lot of secrets that are they're gripping like you want to get to the bottom of 
why things are happening the way that they are you want to get to the bottom of why this person is the way that they are so there's a lot of secrets a lot of things that unfold as you watch so for me it was very easy to watch it really quickly um i watched it in three days both seasons in three days ideally i would have probably finished it in two days but i had stuff to do that i couldn't put off because you know i'm an adult but like yeah it was really easy to watch easy to binge because i mean it keeps you like wanting to watch the next episode because you need answers yeah so i highly 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 recommend this anime for anyone looking for anyone looking for something different something that's not like heavily action based like there's action obviously because they're trying to survive in the forest in the okay in the wilderness but like it's realistic it's like very much survival not like because they know you know special fighting techniques or whatever well some do but like real ones realistic ones it's very much real people dealing with undesirable circumstances so for my people who are still not convinced and don't mind mild spoilers for context you can continue watching this part for those that just want to know what i gave it out of 10 you can skip to this this timestamp. yeah so spoiler alert so the gag is that they are in a post-apocalyptic world and they are there are different groups of people that have de been deployed to continue the human race basically that is the general gist of it and they have been asleep for god knows how many years and when they resurfaced the world as they know it has changed um their new dominant species because the, there were no human beings on the surface of the earth so yeah you know that is the general gist and you know i love post-apocalyptic things if you have been watching any of my previous videos and that's why i was drawn to this anime uh, it's really you know it's always interesting to see how people behave at the end of the world human nature are humans just built to be garbage or do they rise up and you know still hold on to their morals even when they have no legal obligation to you know like will people just do what they want some groups know that there are other groups when they are deployed and others don't know that there are other groups so it's very interesting to see why the reasons why that is the case and some groups are very much for we need to continue the human race and others are very much for the narrative of we are going to do what we want because there's no one to tell us what to do so it's very interesting to see how that all pans out each group has different a different skill set some it's just because they're hot some it's just some it's because they are trained uh in the military background some is because they're smart and like for other other reasons like the different groups exist to give humanity a good chance a good shot at survival you know what i'm saying welcome back spoiler avoiders my overall rating of this anime for me personally is 8 out of 10 i really enjoyed it i really was looking for something different i was not in the mood to see overpowered characters i love my overpowered characters i wasn't in the mood to see magic i just wanted to see people living i'm a huge fan of slice of life if you don't know but like yeah it's a mixture of so many things there's action you know the slice of life it's just i don't even know i think i'll have to find out what it is categorized as i'll probably put it somewhere here but like yeah it's it's just a good you know it's a good fun sometimes stressful sometimes frustrating because sometimes the, the choices that the characters make are really irritating but i mean if everyone was making good choices then there would be no show you know 
so yeah 8 out of 10 and highly highly recommend i i really hope the third season comes out soon because now i am a fan i hope they can keep up the momentum um and i'm really excited to see how things turn out because season two ended on a cliffhanger yay we love to be left in suspense yeah so thank you so much for watching and i hope that you enjoyed this video i hope you are happy that it is short i'm gonna try and make more of my videos short because i know i have been making really really long videos but yeah hey there's not enough hours in a day it's also, it's also easier for me to edit shorter videos <laughs> but like let me know if you want long videos i can be making them sometimes so please like if you enjoyed this video subscribe click on the bell notification if you like what you see i post videos every thursday and yeah bye